Hey, welcome to the first video on my channel. This is my first time editing a video and filming for YouTube. I have been bouncing around on different editing softwares trying to find what works best. I'm filming a review on Vitacup. I decided to get the free sample, which cost me $2.95 shipping. Thanks for watching. So, I was on Instagram and there was an ad for Vitacup. They are K-cups that put vitamins in your coffee. Today I'm trying the Genius Blend, which has MCT oil, turmeric, cinnamon, coffee, and a bunch of vitamins and antioxidants. This Genius Blend tastes a lot like cinnamon. A little bit like turmeric you get the bitterness from the turmeric um, can't taste whatever MCT oil tastes like not familiar with it uh, it's a bold coffee um, but the cinnamon mostly covers up the entire flavor of the coffee so I'm interested to see what's in the next three pods not bad so I'm doing a review on all four pods in this free sample. There is a house blend, french roast, and gourmet breakfast blend. All pods contain coffee, vitamin B1, vitamin B5, B6, B9, B12, D3, and antioxidants. It doesn't say anywhere where the sources are. I'm gonna have to Google it. I went to the Vitacup website and it listed what the vitamin sources are. The Genius Blend has Resuritrol, the antioxidant found in red wine and pomegranate. Folic acid is B9 and pantothenic acid is B5. Remember, vitamins are not FDA regulated and you should talk to your doctor before starting this coffee slash multivitamin. The Vina Cup day two. It's the light roast gourmet breakfast blend, the orange one. I don't like it. Really don't. It, yeah, it tastes musty. It tastes not as good as the last one. A little burnt, a little washed out. I'm not gonna finish this cup of coffee. <laughs> Day two, I don't like you. Maybe the next one will be better. All right, so it's Vita Cup, day three. Today I'm drinking the French roast, dark roast. It's the green one. It's nutty and bold. I still didn't really like it very much, but it was way better than yesterday. I drank the whole thing. End of day three. Okay, Vita Cup, day four. We're doing the Gourmet House Blend Medium Roast. Oh. It's better than yesterday. It's probably the best one actually. It doesn't have the cinnamon flavor. It doesn't have the burnt and watery flavor. It has that toasty, warm flavor, um, a little bit of the nuttiness and the boldness. It's almost like the cup that I had yesterday, but better. Yeah, much better. It's probably the best roast. It's probably why it's the house blend. The sun is shining through a tree, so I guess not the best lighting in the world, but. If you're gonna try um, the Vita Cup and they don't have the sample pack like I purchased, I would recommend that you pick up the Gourmet House Blend Medium Roast because it's the best flavored one, in my opinion, if you like coffees that I like. Okay, so Vita Cup says that they are completely recyclable and compostable. There are even instructions on the back of this package. Step one is to allow them to cool. 
Step two is to remove the foil cover. Step three is to pull on the filter and remove the filter and the coffee together. And here's some coffee grounds all over my hands, which, I mean, yes, they were easy enough to rinse off in the sink, but this is the extra step that you don't usually do with regular K-Cups. You can see here that I got coffee grounds under my fingernails. So since I didn't have a compost personally, my yard is small, I decided I would put the coffee grounds into my rose bushes and also my mother-in-law's rose bushes. We live in a duplex so we share backyards that's why I just hopped over a fence support. <laughs>